Execution level next, no way to explain it. I'm XXX, bitch, triple X rated. Yo, what up guys, Hacks and Inky, doing uh, my first voice tutorial. Um, this tutorial is going to be about custom cold boot, where you can get a custom uh, boot up for your PS3. Let me note that this is only for jailbreak consoles. Alright, let's see, let's get started here. Uh, Alright, so for your first requirements, you're going to need either paint, program, or fo Photoshop. Um, easy static raft converter. Uh, I'm gonna include that for a download. Uh, Alright, first thing you need to do: download and extract the raw file that I included. It's gonna be uh, this thing right here. Um, all right. Now, first thing before you wanna start worrying about this program, you're gonna wanna make what you want the boot up to be. So, you know, open up Photoshop. Mm -hmm. Let's name this custom code boot tutorial. <sighs> Click OK. Um, as you can see here, the background is transparent. I forgot to let you know. Make sure the background is transparent, or else it's going to look retarded as fuck. Testing purposes, I'm not going to make a dope ass background, so don't expect anything tight. Let's see, Let's add some text. Tutorial. Um, let's add one more text. Let's change. Oh yeah, you might see stuff popping up on the side. Don't mind them. They're just getting sneak peek. <laughs> okay. Tutorial. Axing. Oh. my name and PlayStation buttons, by the way. Okay, now once you do that, you're going to want to save save it as a, uh, a PNG photo file. Save it onto your desktop. Save. Okay. Now we go. This is where we open the program. Run. Eventually load. Okay, here we go. You go to desktop, find the picture you want to upload and add as your cold boot. Open. Now you want to see your preview, so click on show preview. Boom, there we go. That's that image I just made. Now you can. These, if you're going to make the, the formatting of the picture, what is this? Um. 1920 by 1080 don't worry about these positions here just make sure you position it how you want to before you save it on Photoshop and once you do that you can specify output go to convert I'll save this onto my desktop go to OK it's going to do its thing done now it's going to create a folder on your desktop click on that have a preview and a cold boot. 
there you go that's the preview of what the code boot's going to look like and here's the code boot itself now what you want to do to install this onto your jailbreak ps3 so, uh, let's see we're going to run files delivers so you guys can see on my jailbreak all right here we go this is my jailbreak right here i already had it uh, set up so you can just look at it this is a rebug toolbox you're going to want to run rebug toolbox Once we have rebug on, we go back to our filezilla. Oh, hold on. I don't like this cluttered. Alright, connect to your PS3. Now we're going to go to the following directories right here. We're going to go dev rebug, because this is your system flash, VSH, resources, and here we are, resources. This is the regular cold boot that I have right here. And this is the new one. We're going to drag and drop. And we're going to overwrite. Click to overwrite. Once we do that, we're going to restart my PS3. Let's see. You can just restart from Rebug Toolbox. And we're going to do a full on off cycle. Let's hope this worked. There we go. Tutorial hacks and ink, cold boot, custom cold boot, installation. And that's how you do it. It's really not too hard. Make sure to uh, subscribe and like. Um, if you have any more questions about jailbreaks and anything else, ask me. Oh, also, shout out to Hacks and Zeus and everybody else in the Unexpected Poop. Uh, you guys are more than great. Have a nice day.